So many times on a hot summer evening, you probably know exactly what you're gonna to toss on the grill and you don't wanna heat up the kitchen and you just think, what can I have as a side dish? So at those times, I go to something really nice and cool and this recipe I'm preparing tonight is exactly that. It's a Greek chickpea salad. It's got lots of texture, lots of flavor. It's really fresh and it just goes with about anything you'd make on the grill and you don't have to heat up the kitchen. So I'll show you how quick and easy it is to put together. First of all, I just mix up my own Greek dressing and it's so easy. Once you have this down, you'll want some in your refrigerator all the time. I've got a quarter cup of extra virgin olive oil. I've got a couple tablespoons of red wine vinegar and I minced up really, really fine one clove, a pretty chubby clove of garlic and I've got some dried herbs. Sometimes I use just oregano. Today I'm using an Italian seasoning. So it's a blend of things like oregano and basil, a little bit of thyme, some fennel, maybe a little bit of red pepper. And there's no salt in it. And then I'm going to add just a little squeeze of some lemon juice to really brighten it up. Now I'll eat just a couple teaspoons probably is all you need. And a tiny bit of salt and a little bit of black pepper, and that's all there is to it. So since this is a Greek chickpea salad, I'm going to start with some chickpeas that have been rinsed and drained. There's two cans here, and I had some cucumber in the fridge. Now this is one of the beauties of this salad. You can put any kind of vegetables you'd like into the chickpea salad. So some cucumbers and I've got some red pepper and you'll notice I chop everything really, really pretty small for this salad. And I've got some red onion. Sometimes I put in celery, sometimes I put in some fresh parsley. I didn't, I don't have any fresh parsley in my garden right now, but I did have some fresh mint. So I'm going to put in a little bit of fresh mint. You could add some fresh basil. And I'm going to toss this up a little bit before I add the dressing. And just enough to coat all of the ingredients. And once this is ready to serve, Right at the last minute, I'll add some chopped fresh tomato, and sometimes I add a little bit of chopped avocado. So there you have it, a really nice, cool Greek chickpea salad for a hot summer night. I'm Sue Doden, sharing Good Food for Good Life 365.